Yep, you're good. Okay, I think you're going to be. Okay. Uh, so, my opponent states that uh, there are safer uh, alternative or safer painkillers uh, to met, uh, so we don't have to use medical marijuana. Then why haven't we used those painkillers? Because according to the BBC, 25% of painkiller deaths have decreased since uh, people started using medical marijuana as a painkiller. Um, earlier, you also mentioned that it is a, it is a, it's a psychosis, and um, uh, and uh, according to drugpolicy.org, uh, there is no compelling evidence that marijuana causes some psychotic disorders in uh, in otherwise. Um, uh, healthy individuals, most tellingly, uh, rates of schizophrenia uh, and other psychotic or yeah psychotic uh, illnesses have um, remained flat even during uh, periods of time when marijuana use rates have increased. So, it doesn't mess with your head, first off. Um, also, they mentioned earlier that uh, it uh, increases, or it's the leading cause of traffic accidents. And uh, my opponent has already gone over that, saying that, well, people who are found with uh, traffic accidents with THC in their blood is usually, are usually found with alcohol in their blood. Um, but also, but also, according to the CDC, the uh, MIH, and uh, the NBC, uh, they found that alcohol kills 88,000 people a year. Uh, or, no, tobacco kills 88,000 people a year. Uh, alcohol kills 480,000 people a year. And marijuana has found to really kill none. Um, and going on. Uh, my other opponent's claims about the black market, uh, that, or more of his claims about people in prison, that only a uh, small percentage of people are in prison for marijuana. Um, well, that small percentage is still huge compared to how many people are in prison. So it's not like a cup of water and then you got a little droplet. It's maybe hundreds of thousands of people. Um, and most drug arrests are marijuana arrests. One minute. Uh, according to the FBI, six, uh, 650,000 people were arrested for marijuana laws, uh, marijuana violations, and that made up about 40% of uh, drug arrests. That's a lot, and uh, that's, that's all I have time for. Thank you.